Uh, we are here to answer questions on Christmas. I'm supposed to be good at that because I love Christmas. I'm obviously good at it. I'm going to win. In this country, the patron saint of Christmas isn't just Santa. Another symbol of Christmas is a man taking a shit. What country is that? The Finns like to do weird shit. People take dump everywhere in Singapore and I think it's got to do a lot with the... I don't know, it just feels like an Ireland picture. What? Oh, it was Spain. Represents fertility and good luck. How is shit fertility, sir? You're shitting me! In this country, Santa replies your letters. His address is North Pole Ho. Oh ho, country. Ho oh ho. Ho ho. Finland? Why is Finland? Is Finland not ho? That's where Santa lives, right? If oh, I become oh, Santa, oh. I will move to South Pole so that all the letters don't come to me. I demand that we put a small globe here and I turn it and then whatever my finger like lands on, I'll write it down. Santa live in a country? It's Alaska live in a country? <laughs> Nonsense Seriously, the answer is Canada, okay? The tradition started from a bunch of parents intercepting the letters sent by the kids to Santa. Maybe I should let send a letter to Canada. You try Singapore? Oh, your letter to Santa. In this country, after decorating a Christmas tree, they hide a sometimes plastic pickle within its branches. Why would you hide pickle? It's disgusting. Where does pickle come from, Sia? I think they like to eat pickles in anything and everything. Pickles and like, it looks like peppers. I'm not even so sure if pickles originated from Italy. The tradition started from a POW managing to grab a pickle from the guards, which oh. ended up saving his life. Wait, so weird, does Germany look like a pickle though? In this country, one of their Christmas traditions is carving nativity scenes out of radishes. Why does it sound so Asian? <laughs> I am thinking of Kung Fu Panda. I think the clue is somewhere the outfit is. I'm thinking it's not Middle East because it's Christmas. The night of the radishes originated from the merchants coming up with wood carvings to attract sales during Christmas. Jesus wasn't born in Mexico. <laughs> I honestly thought radish was China. Talk to me about Deepavali and I'll win. A bucket of Colonel's finest chicken is a part of the traditional. Why would you eat KFC during Christmas? Hey wait, is that wonton? That looks like wonton eh. It's that chocolate cake thing like a hint. It's Japan, this one is Japan. This is Japan. Why am I reading that? Why am I saying that? <laughs> Japan. Japan. You got it right? You got it right? Yeah. So I got it wrong. Oh. oh. Pian no Randa. Pian Randa. If it was Japan, there would have been a wasabi. There was no wasabi. In this country, part of the traditional Christmas food platter is rotten fish marinated in what? Lie? Wait, they eat soap? China people. They, they eat like fish, some weird fish thing. Fish curry ma. So, you know fish, you know anything to do with fish, just go inside la. They used to pickle the fishes to make them last longer during winter, but now it's more for tradition. Fish, rotten or not, just eat lor. It's fish what? Christmas made me feel stupid today. Still gross though. Yeah. Won't eat it. I wonder how it tastes like. No, I don't want to know. Do you want to know? No. You said you wanted to figure out how it tastes like, right? Shit, no! Ew! Fuck. Rotten fish marinated in lime. Looks like salmon. Raw? <laughs> I feel like I'm dying already. <laughs> it's not like pickled smoke fish. Oh. <laughs> that too dead. It's damn disgusting. The taste yeah. lingers, it's so disgusting. I'm enjoying it. Is there any more? We would like to wish all our viewers Merry Christmas! Ho ho ho! Ho ho ho!